Uh, tough one to take today. What's your thoughts on the match? I uh, thought the first half was a pretty even game. I thought we passed the ball quite well. We had a couple of, kind of sniffs around the box, we just couldn't get a shot away. Um, it's a pretty even first half up and, and then coming out at half time. Uh, again, it was fairly even. First goal, it was kind of their throw and they get out, work it around the other side of the pitch and then we don't defend it properly. Uh, the ball flashed across the box and the boys got a tap in. The second goal, Looked like n not really, kind of was didn't look like the most powerful strike, but the boys found or what looks from my angle found the corner, um, and we you know we continued to kind of press, we continued to pass the ball, just thought we should have sped the play up a little bit more, but then we've got a chance at the end, uh, obviously that and kind of just just bang on forty five minutes, we miss the penalty, and then obviously if we that that goes in, you, you never know, but again you can't fault the players' effort, you can't fault their endeavour. Uh, some of the quality was good, some of the decision making not so good. Um, but we, we've got we have to turn around, uh, so we've got Christmas in between now and uh, the game on Boxing Day. The dressing room's a little bit uh, disheartened just because they felt that they you know, should have maybe got some from the game. But we've got to go and turn that around on uh, Tuesday. We've got back to back games against Cowden Beef, one at home, obviously, and then one away from home. Um, but you know, the, the, the place was you know happy, and obviously, with the win and performance last week. And it was a good training training camp this week. Um, obviously, don't have any training between now and uh, Tuesday. It's important the players kind of switch off between now and then, and then when they wake up on Tuesday morning, and then focus for the game against Cowden Beef. We've touched a little bit uh, on what we might expect from them on Tuesday because we don't have the players in between now and then. Um, but we've got kind of we, we go again. Um, and uh, yeah, so, I mean there was some good individual performances today. Some not so good, maybe a little bit below par. And it's up if the boys get the opportunity to go and play on. Tuesday, it's up to them to kind of go and show what they can do. Uh, Look, the more uh, likely to score up until maybe the 61st minute. Uh, what do you think we do to try and turn the possession, the positive energy into goals? I think uh, obviously the way that uh, Civil uh, play, they have quite a num number of bodies behind the, uh, behind the ball. Uh, they defend their box quite well um, and they're, they're good on the transition in terms of on the breakaway. So I think today it was maybe moving the ball a little bit quicker. If we could move the ball a little bit quicker, we're trying to kind of isolate and get Sean or Scotty one v one. And I felt you know some of the just that final ball, whether it was them individually or the ball going to them, uh, maybe wasn't quite at it today. Whereas obviously in previous weeks, uh, we've created a number of chances and it's just maybe sticking them in. You know, some sometimes a guilt edge some chance uh, uh, times. Today there wasn't really too many guilt edge chances that they said, oh, he should have scored or that should have scored. It was just more the ball falling to us, but because they had so many numbers back around the ball, they make it tough for us. Um, and then, yeah, you're up until that 61st minute, you know, the first goal kind of changed the momentum of the game a little bit. But then, you know, the boys did compose themselves and, you know, once it went to 2-0, we got right back in the game.